In today's video, I'm going to show you five combos using an Aisha. As always, make sure you have been safely taught how to do these moves before giving them a go. Aerial invert, to a hang glider, to a pegasus, to a twisted grip Aisha, into an inverted D. Make sure you give yourself enough height going into the hang glider as you do lose quite a lot of height for the end of this combo. If you're not a fan of the pegasus, of course you can cut it out, but hopefully going from a hang glider gives you a nice setup. You can use that top foot to help you twist into the twisted grip Aisha, and then once you're there, hopefully your inverted D will feel nice and easy. Apprentice, to an Aisha, to a tulip, to a butterfly, to an Aisha handstand, into a little split. From your apprentice to your Aisha, you can use that top foot on the pole if you need to, to help you twist into your Aisha. Lower nice and slowly into your tulip to help you keep control, and then you can use that top foot to get you back into the butterfly. You should hopefully be in a really nice height to go into a handstand Aisha, and hopefully you can pause in this little split before coming down to the floor. Climb to a cross knee release, to an Aisha, into a climb over, into a Superman. I like to climb twice and then have a little pull up before going into the cross knee release, as you will lose quite a lot of height going into the Aisha. I prefer keeping the same arm as the straight leg highest before twisting into the twisted grip Aisha, but you can do your hands the other way around. Hook the same leg as the bottom arm before coming into your climb over and sneaking the same leg as the top arm through the gap between your top arm and bottom leg before going into your Superman. Handspring to an Aisha, to a Poisson, to a flatline Scorpio, to a mini flip out. Turn your chest to the ceiling as you switch your legs over for the flatline Scorpio and you will be really, really low for it. I'm going into a thumb up handspring for this one and then hooking the same foot as the top arm before going into this little poisson. So the mini flip we do at the end is just a tiny bounce with the outside leg to help you take your inside leg off the pole into the floor. If you were higher, it would be bigger, but we are not higher, so let's make it small. Spinning chopper to a flatline Scorpio to an Aisha to a shoulder mount straddle, to an apprentice. When you go from the flatline Scorpio to the Aisha, your bottom hand will be almost on the floor, so try to keep yourself higher. Give yourself loads of momentum going into your spinning chopper and hooking your inside leg, but try not to drop too low. We then hook the same leg as the top arm before bringing the bottom hand into a cup grip and coming into a shoulder mount on that shoulder. Your top arm still stays in a thumb up grip. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you want to see some of our other combo videos, I've got those for you as well.